going into this game, um, I feel a lot more experienced as an athlete and matured a lot more over the last four years. Going into London, it was all about the experience. I wanted to get in there, um, enjoy the comp, enjoy everything that the Olympic Games entails. And going into this competition, I'm a lot more focused on myself and about the result. I've, I've been always, my whole journey has been looking towards Rio and going into this competition I'm, I'm feeling a lot more confident and a lot more prepared and um, in terms of outcomes I'm, I'm looking to get in there and um, put up some solid routines, make the first step, make the finals and after that just really, really um, hit home and put the pressure on the other competitors and see what happens. So um, I think this experience is, is going to be um, a good one in, in the sense that I feel, I feel ready and I feel, feel good but I think the atmosphere is going to be something that is going to be different to, to London in sense of, I guess, the Brazilian culture and, and I guess it's um, the vibe that it has as a city. So I think that's exciting as well. No, I'm, I'm excited. I think we have a Brazilian um, at this Olympic Games in my event. Um, so I'll be competing against um, a home competitor. And I think that just makes the crowd a lot more into it and a lot more enthusiastic. I think going into a competition where you know there's someone from the hometown, um, from London, I, unfortunately there was no um, male p competitor from, from Britain, but in the women's event you could just see the crowd getting into it a lot more. And So I really look forward to going in and um, the culture of trampolining is, is, yeah, we're competitors, but everyone's really good friends off, off, off um, out of the competition. and so. Um, I think everyone's going to go in there and, and have a lot of fun and I think the crowd's going to be, no, I'm not afraid and I think I'm just going to use that kind of um, adrenaline to, I guess, um, pip the Brazilian, I guess.